My views about same-sex marriage have evolved over the years. Uh, when I ran for governor in 1998 was the first time I recall uh, the issue uh, coming up. And it only was voiced by a few people who uh, lived mostly in the San Francisco neighborhoods. I remember thinking about it and uh, deciding that stable relationships of consenting adults are surely more important than ancient stereotypes of a marriage between a man and a woman. And that's when I formed a view that I was for, um, letting, for letting states decide if they want uh, to permit um, uh, same-sex marriages. And that's been the view I've held ever since. There was a homophobic law that Congress passed called the Defense of Marriage Act designed to prevent states from giving recognition to marriages, same-sex marriages in other states. Uh, that law passed overwhelmingly in the 90s. Uh, that was a time when the district I represented was a lean Republican seat. And I don't recall any Republicans uh, voting against uh, the so-called DOMA. Uh, but I went down to the floor of the House uh, and was one of 67 people out of 435 to vote against it. And I remember as I, as I went to do that, that uh, uh, my friend and colleague, Nancy Pelosi, who was then not in the leadership, came up to me uh, concerned and said, do you think you really should make this vote? Of course, she was making it. And I said, you bet. And not only am I going to make this vote, but I'm going to speak against this. And I'm very proud of that vote.